So tonight I'm talking about golf cart Gale. Another racist turkey trying to get in between black parent. And so this racist bigot, she had the nerve while she was all over bre breathing and bearing like a big oversized bear, like a koala bear. She had nothing else better to do with her lame time. Black father was telling his son soccer game to respect the ref's choice. It was getting talking as a parent. And this this old Betty gets her mouth all in the mix. Like she's trying to stir it like it's her Kool-Aid. She's trying to stir the mix up. And she way out of pocket. You know. See, <laughs> not only is she racist, but she out of pocket. Okay. She gonna try to tell this man. She gonna call the cops. Because he's talking to his son. Do you, you know, do you know the audacity to do such a thing? But see, this this Trump uh ideology and this mindset, these turkeys have gotten wild. They say and do whatever they please. They don't have no, they have no filter, no recourse. But you see, you know what? That brother threw something back at her though. You know, how are you gonna sit there and call the police because you don't like how a black man or black person talking to their child? How idiotic and crackheadish is that? Hmm? It's kind of funny because <laughs> <laughs> we go back to slavery and back in the day, black folks was taking care of white babies, but no one talks about that though. Mm -hmm. You know, uh huh. No one talks about, you know, gone with the wind or nothing like that. Had McDaniel all the help. Mm hmm. When Viola Davis and all that. See, it ain't just, there ain't no movies. Those are real life stories. But anyway, that's another story, another time. But how are you going to sit there? and do something like that and call yourself sane. So this this old this old chick was sitting on a, a cart and she called the police. And how come these lame racist cops don't even have the nerve to find these people or embarrass them? You know, like, it's funny. Yeah, I think it's just as bad as if you're going to get at a John for soliciting prostitution, you should get at these lying, false calling people who be making false acquisitions and get at them and say yo you know you out of you out of line you should be soliciting your you should get a warning for making false acquisitions but then again this is america they've done it for time and memorial you know from emmett till and anything so you know they sit there and they'll lie and these racist cops they don't care about black folks so they sit there and they'll take that call they'll sit there and they was talking to the black man i saw that thing i was like he ain't do nothing wrong he ain't, he ain't do that wrong. This is just as bad as the racist NFL that suspended Adrian Peterson for whipping his ch child's behind. I'm like, and they don't want black folks to do nothing. They want to whip you and condition you, but they don't want you to have no rights. That's what it boils down to. So when you see some idiocy like this, this is just another example of white supremacy. When this idiotic woman can call the police and golf cart carry can sit on her behind and just lie. That's all she did. That's just lie, you know. So, you know, that old sorry turkey. She need to roll over that hill. And I ain't got no no respect for the, all this garbage that's going on. Cause you just got these white folks come out here, anything they feel like it. Next they just be calling the police on you cause you're breathing being black, you know. If you black and you got just if you just say I'm black, they'll probably call the police on you for that. I mean, this just this foolery is ridiculous, and it's all that racist Trump Pence garbage, all that garbage. Anyway, that's my take. Hurry to hit them comments. Hit that subscribe. Peace.